everyone, it's Frog here. Today, we'll be riding the first run of the R211A train cars. This is the second ride in the series, so make sure to watch the first one linked in the description.
Until someone looks behind the cinder block wall blocking the station, 76th Street will be a mystery.
Here in the railway line, there are a ton of abandoned stations along Jamaica Bay Trestle. I point them out for you when we pass them. This is a far Rockaway bound A train. The next stop is Broad Channel. And clear of the closing doors, please.
This is Hamilton Beach Station at Queens Coast. Throughout its lifetime, the station was nothing more than two shelter tracks along both platforms. It opened in 1919 and closed in 1955 due to the NYCTA purchasing the line. Station. The station was located on the north side of the Goose Creek section of the trestle. The station had no address similar to the Howard's Landing, although it didn't have a station house. It was built in 1888 for fishers using the island. It was closed in 1935 and all of Goose Creek's buildings were demolished by 1940. Station. The station had no address or station house similar to Goose Creek. It was built in 1888, the same year as Goose Creek for the same purpose. On May 7, 1950, a fire destroyed the Jamaica Bay section of the trestle. It closed on the 23rd of that month. Yeah. 
best curve is available to the shuttle and A train to Rockaway Park. of the abandoned stations. Let's turn on to the branch that takes us to Far Rockaway and enjoy some sped up footage of the Rockaway line.
watching part two of the RC11A first run. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like and subscribe. I'll see you next week on the Muni Pals version of the Rockaway line. <laughs>